In this video I'm using a Dr. Stifler type setup. Except with this I have the trigger coil coming off the positive side. I did it this way so I can have the primary and the trigger coil next to each other and use this piece of ferrite to tune it along with this veritable capacitor. That way I can find the spatial resonance of a larger coil or a very small coil. See both ends of this L1 coil are free. For this test I'll be running it off a AA battery. Here's the other end of the large coil. Touch the end, it affects it quite a bit, but it doesn't totally kill the light. Spatial resonance of this coil is just a little over 2 megahertz. If you don't have a spectrum analyzer, you can use a cheap meter like this one. Put it on hertz. Just use one side, and let the other side float free. Reads the same as a spectrum analyzer.